Bundy's garage. Bundy here. Magnifying magnetic inline filter. This came from a client of mine who was on his transmission. Came off a Honda Accord. I've seen one video online where a guy actually cuts this thing open to see what it looks like on the inside. And that is what I'm planning to do here. Here's the actual old filter that it came in. I should put some gloves on for this, huh? Got the gloves on. Gonna pull the filter out. Try to leave all that other transmission fluid in there. Let that drain out for a second. I don't know how many miles are on this filter. What a nasty mess. Alright, put that there. See if I can just cut this thing open with a razor blade. Got my trusty handy dandy razor blade here. If I don't slice my finger open. Nope. It's a little bit tougher than what a razor blade will do. Razor blade's not going to do anything to that. Man, they don't make this thing easy, do they? Let's see if I cut along this seam. This tool is used for PVC pipe. If I can get the jaws open wide enough, maybe I can get in there to actually cut this thing open. Man, how did that guy open this thing up? What else can I use? I don't know if this case is made out of metal or what. No, it's plastic. This is very hard and tough plastic. Okay, let's try this axe. So I smash my finger open. <laughs> I'm going to take it to the ground real quick, see if I can do it better on the ground. This is one tough sucker, man. Look at that. Let's see if I can get my uh, pliers in there. I had to use an axe to get that open. Okay, I had to basically split this thing open with an axe. There we go. At least you know it's well constructed, huh? So there's a filter. And then the magical part is a magnet in there. There you go. This is the part that holds all the junk, all the magnetic material. Looks like it did its job. Let me grab a clean paper towel here. We'll wipe it all off, see what comes off. So yeah, traps the dirt with this magnetic filter. Magnifying. I know they come in three different sizes. So just depending on what size your line is is the one you need to get so there's a magnet see it's very strong it's got decent holding power not a not a, a rare earth magnet or anything but it's got decent it'll, it'll catch the particles that you needed to catch the element just looks like a regular paper element Nothing special.
This whole thing is pretty well constructed. And I'm doing this more out of curiosity than anything. I just I had heard about these filters not too long ago. Just wanted to see what the deal is with them. So I tried to separate the paper element just by cutting into it. But uh and see if I can get the end off. It is not happening. But I think this is a great idea. If you wanted to put this in line with the power steering, put this in line with your automatic transmission. You can also do it for your oil cooler line. Yeah, that thing is not coming off. Nope, that cap's not coming off, but yeah. So yeah, magnifying inline magnetic filter. Had to, this casing is no joke. This stuff is pretty thick. Quarter of an inch, if not more. How to use an axe to get it open. Magnet. Seems fairly strong. I've seen stronger magnets, but it's decent for what you're trying to do here. Paper element seems seems good as well. So, like I said, it was more for me to see what was inside of one of these filters. If you have found any of my videos helpful, please consider subscribing to Bundy's Garage. Questions, comments, concerns, you can email me at bundysgarage at gmail.com. And like always, I'll keep them rolling for you.